All right, welcome to the Crypto Boss Engine channel. Let's look at audio. The coin, um, the weekly time frame is putting in a lower high. That's not a good sign. Um, so right now, right now, I'm looking for this to make a lower low here. Uh, it's just, it just audio does not look good. Just out based on the weekly time frame alone. Um, Twelve cents. If you, you know, I could see this coming all the way back to twelve cents and then lower. The three-day chart for audio right now is overbought, making a lower high. The daily chart right now does not look good either. Um, daily chart is like, I don't know. It just doesn't look good. Um, you're above the twenty-one day moving average, so if you can hold the twenty-one day moving average at sixteen seven, then maybe you have a fighting chance of a, of continuing the uptrend. But you're also at resistance here at twenty-one. You can see that you try to use this. At, you've been using this for, for resistance ever since the uh, 24th of June of this year. So really, you've tested this level. This is your third time test stand. Um, so if you break 21, it could be a massive breakout, at least at the 200-day moving average, but at 28. But for right now, I'm not super bullish on what I'm seeing on audio coin. Uh, the four-hour time frame right now is over, so I'll try to make a higher low. I think the price is stay above is 17.5 because that's where the 21 day moving average is on the daily time frame. Let's go back to the daily time frame. Yeah, that's where it's at. Is that 20? No, it's at 16.7. So it has to stay above 16.7 to remain bullish. The one hour time frame right now is trying to put in a higher low. So the one hour time frame is trying to get the bounce off the 21 day moving or the 200 day moving average, I should say. So if you can do that, that's a good sign. Um, I would just be cautious about this right now. Uh, I think you're on key support. You can't lose 16.7. If you do, it's not going to be good. And if you do lose 16.7, I would look be looking for 12 on the macro time frames. Now, if we go to the upside and if it does break out bullishly, uh, if you break 21, I could be seeing a move all the way to the 200 moving average here at 28 or almost 29. Um, but the next macro resistance I would be looking for audio would be all the way up there at 37, 38, at least on the daily time frames where you put in um, a high at 40. Point five, and then a high at 44 basically so basically that but without if you're not using the wicks the resistance is 38 so that's what i'm looking at for audio those are the bearish and bullish look places to look out for based on the fact you're overbought on the three day and weekly and a lot of coins are starting the road to the downside i'd be cautious and maybe even consider a short not financial advice but that's uh, my update for audio if you guys have requests for other altcoins let me know in the comment section below and i'll see you guys in the next update